The commons are those resources that are shared in common. The air we breathe, the water we drink. Enclosures are a process by which uh, corporations, market forces, often in collusion with government, commodify and privatize things that belong to all of us. If you want to get something different besides enclosure, how about theft? There's a balance between private property and commons property, and the balance has gotten way too much in the direction of private property. We've allowed oil companies and coal companies to use the atmosphere as a free, open sewer. And that's why they're the most profitable industry on Earth. The whole fight over global warming is essentially a fight to make the atmosphere a public space, not a private one. That's what this fight is about. 2014 officially marks the end of net neutrality as we know it. The fight for internet freedom becomes very real and present for many Americans. Without even basic information and data available for everyone. We're really limited in the kinds of solutions that we can come up with. The human spirit has to rebel. It has to assert its own imperatives. And I think that's what's happening uh, in the commons movement as well. It's like, no, let's reorder our institutional relationships and policies to serve us instead of us fitting into boxes as consumers and wage slaves for a system that is destroying the planet. There's been this lack of care that's been created. Corporations can have policies that are destroying the earth, polluting our waters, and they don't care. This like, I don't care mentality is being erased here. This is the resurrection of care. People are caring about each other. People are caring about the issues facing our world and our future. Community is becoming more and more important across the country. I think uh, Occupy highlighted that and, and really gave a boost to that movement to concentrate funding versus spending your money with the national corporations, for example. Employee-owned companies reinvest their wealth. Those extra monies are not going into the pockets of upper management and the board of directors, but that extra money is being reinvested back into the community. To me, it's about moving away from individualism and possessiveness of the sense of ownership of things. And it works better when we share what we have. We learned this first in kindergarten, and we can still do it.